So that's a direct quote. A woman relinquishes her unfettered right to control her own body when her actions cause the conception of a baby. That's terrifying. That's stupid. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's crazy. You know, I totally disagree with that remark. I think everyone has a right to control their own body. Apparently my blood pressure doesn't register on the camera, but that would make it's an infuriating remark to make. How about considering the effect on both cost and recidivism for illegals who are sent to do their time in a private prison in China? Illegals could be incarcerated for less than $10,000 per year. <laughs> wow, that's kind of immoral. Oh, because it costs less? Right. Oh, that's bull****. Tragic week in review, this past week has been like no other. On Monday, the world witnessed the tragedy of Virginia Tech in Blacksburg, Virginia. On Tuesday, Oregon witnessed the passage of domestic benefits for same-sex couples and civil rights based on a sexual orientation. Okay, so he's equating uh, a gun shooting to the approval of gay marriage. Right, okay. Yeah. Ow! This kind of a comparison is uh, not only odious, but just doesn't reflect anything about reality. Well, this is so absurd, it scarcely requires a response. I'd be very nervous about having this kind of person running our state. This is really shocking to me, and I'm not a um, very political person, I don't watch television, but I do have some core values, and that's not reflected in a single word on that page. I would never vote for Dennis Richardson in a million years. 